how to make a flashy in-screen card that's all animated and sexy. Here we go! And welcome back to another video. I'm Alan Spicer, your YouTube certified expert. Now, one of the most powerful things that I ever use on my YouTube channel is my end screen. But you can also make it even more eye-catching. Some animation, some wonderful video backgrounds, all with an aid to make sure that they click that, that next video to get you more watch time. With help from Placeit, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Let's go to the computer. End cards are a very important thing for driving additional traffic. You can make your very own custom one from Placeit.net by going to videos, then you go to video end cards. They have a wide selection of end cards. You'll probably recognize the style and the set out of some of them. Obviously you get your, your video, your subscription button, and some kind of message, right? They have a good collection of templates. Some are free, some are not, right? But I'm gonna randomly pick say this one. And here you can see that it's scrolling through. And in the background, you've got your musician. It flashes up the channel text. It's got your two videos that you can put there, right? It has your subscribe button. And obviously what you do is when it gets to the end screen, you'd add the videos overlaying this at the end of your video. You can have it say anything that you want, really. So this video would be like next video. It could, it could be suggested video or playlist that you like. And then change the demo a little bit. So you can now say that it's playlist and previous video. Um, the, the text that's on the right hand side that says subscribe to our other channel. So I'm going to change it. And you can keep editing it until you're absolutely happy. So I'm, I'm keeping to go through the text so you can see. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. I can add it to as many lines as I want until it auto fills. It will resize for that box. There you go. So you can write anything that you want. The colors, once again, you can change the colors. On the right hand side so if you're very much more of a, a pink rather than a red then it changes the pink uh, so it changes all the pink colors um you can change the the music that's involved at any point by going to the top right hand corner i'm not going to play you the audio here but i will play you the full end screen at the end of this video so you can see what it looks like but you can pick from abstract asia christmas clapping driving ethnic grunge, rock, young, zen, vocal, right? You can test them, you can search them. If you're not too sure on the background, not a problem. You can just change the background. So now all of a sudden it's a yoga back frame and it's all in pink or, oh, once again, you can change it and now it's a rock event. It could be absolutely anything you want. They've got some stock imagery on the right hand side. You can scroll through it at any point. You can make it about absolutely anything you want. The more you scroll, the more it loads as well. So it could be dogs if you so wish. Let's try the, the doggy one because everyone loves dogs. Here you go. I've clicked it. It will render it out just as a preview. Here you go. Doggies in the background. I click full preview. It will now prepare the video going through all of your options, your font, your color schemes, your music. So there you'll see it's all loaded and everything's there. I'll now play it for you with the audio so I'll see how it looks. But that is how I make an end screen using Place It. If you like what I did today, there's a link in the description down below. There's some playlists here to show some more fancy tips. 